McGrath is going to run into trouble, but things sticking and moving for Leeds United here. Spencer, across it goes, and Leeds United hit the front. Sliding in is Max Dean. Here come United again, breathless. It is. Here's McNeil. Oh, in towards Hugovev, wide. That would have been a splendid goal, and Hugovev knows that that is a big chance. And now Garnacho on the turn, lovely turn from him. Garnacho and Kenner in the way. McNeil, he's hung that up well, and Hugovev has taken his chance this time. Splendid header, the combination of McNeil and Hugovev again to perfection, and just what United needed, it's 1-1. It comes from Savage. Kept alive here. Surely another one, and it is for United's goal machine. The ultimate poacher, that is Charlie McNeil. And all of a sudden, it has been changed around, and Manchester United now lead. McNeil, who scored a couple of goals against Leeds in the reverse, and they won by four goals to nil at the ATC. Got a penalty, and Savage and Iqbal were also on target on that day. And here is McNeil again. Is it to be three? Oh, you bet it is. Wow, that is so good. And Charlie McNeil, quick fire goals, and United are in absolute control. Let's breathe some life back into Leeds, perhaps. It's Snowden. Oh, he's found the corner too. And out of nothing, all of a sudden, Leeds are right back in this game. What's on for Mainu? Fernandez. Oh, surely no. What a chance to put the game to bed. Big moment for Amari Forson. Here's Wellens now for United. Forson and for Wellens again. Chance to win it and seal it, and he has done. That will do so nicely for Manchester United. Charlie Wellens just kept on going, and the vision to find him from Forson. And that is four. And that is all three points. Some second half this has been for Manchester United this afternoon. Neil, congratulations, an important win and one I'm sure you'll be very pleased with. Yeah, it's, it's that time of year, you know, the results and points are on the, on the table now. Of course, the uh, boys are aware of it. So, um, yeah, coming away and, and, and getting the win was important. But i always going to refer to the performance and how we play. So, uh, you know, I want to stand by that and... There were some good things, some really good play and, and some opportunities that we created that we didn't put in the net. Um, but also some defensive things to pick up on and, and just being ready for, for counter-attack and being ready for, for uh, long direct play. And, 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 and we spoke about that pre-game. Pre and yeah, we had some, some moments where we would like to defend better. But um, yeah, overall, some, some good stuff and some nice goals. Well, we could see the intensity in that first half, but it seems to improve massively in the second half. And the press was so organised, and it led to a couple of early goals in the second half. Yeah, you, 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 um, we have a, a set way of how we set up against them, and uh, we spoke about that. And the lads carried it off really well. And uh, at times we uh, were on the front foot and, and got joy when we uh, pressed them high. And uh, we should have had a few more goals really from that. But yeah, no, pleased with that.